I have here the official copy of the Stanley Myers Coroner's Report. This is the findings and facts and verdict of the coroner of Franklin County in Columbus, Ohio. Rupture of cerebral artery aneurysm. He uh, has the uh, his wife's name here, Marilyn Meyer. This was their address in Columbus at the time. Here's some things that are on this here. Uh, circumstances surrounding death. Uh, descendant supposedly at lunch with NATO. Um, this really bothers me. When you write supposedly in a government document, um, I, I'm just not sure if that's professional. But if you read this statement, you can kind of tell that the coroner was already questioning whether he was actually poisoned or not and, and, and just dismissed being poisoned as such a blatant uh, lie and not true. Um, I think a brain aneurysm is a very convenient way for somebody to die and if they were poisoned that can cause that. Um, I know several uh, people in the medical field and I've talked to them about that and they've said the same thing. Um, anyway, it says here, uh, supposedly at lunch with NATO officials at a Cracker Barrel diner, the group made an opening toast with cranberry juice immediately after which descendant ran outside followed by his brother then vomited violently and told his brother that he had been poisoned um, he died a few minutes later um, his brother had, sticks to that story too um, they didn't find any poisons in his system supposedly in this uh, in this uh, report but I don't know. I mean, come on. The guy's been working on a water car, and he dies after he's getting ready to sign the contract. You can get this report um, from the Franklin County Coroner's Office. I can send you a copy of it for a few bucks if you want to. Um, I'm going to be doing a series of videos on uh, some of Stanley Meyer's work. I'm also going to go into, does voltage alone do work? And... Uh, I'm going to kick off my series of videos with this video right here of Stanley Myers Coroner Report. I thought uh, maybe people would find that interesting. Um, they have some things in here of what was in his blood, but it didn't, it didn't really show anything that was poisonous that I saw. But, hey, you know what? All they had to do was slip that guy 50 grand. And um, When I did talk to the coroner on the phone, he was... Um, standoffish about talking about the Stanley Meyer case. Um, he got really angry when I started really drilling for questions and it was kind of a heated conversation and ended up with him hanging up on me. And this was his name right here and his phone number. I tell you, I'm telling you to call him and uh, bug him about this because um, I think Stanley Meyer was poisoned and I think that they should have done a little bit more uh, to investigate this. There's his number, right? there. I'll see you guys on my next video.